Hi guys, this is Yadu Yash. Welcome back to another video. So today in this video, we will be taking a look at the few of the laptops which you can buy in today's market for a better performance and for your daily use or maybe for your light gaming also. So these five laptops are the best at its prices and I also want to just inform you that, you know, this was recorded during the sale and there would be a difference of 2000 to 3000 rupees uh, by the time you are watching this video, right? Because the, the laptop market is so saturated now and the demand is so high that the prices are changing literally like each and every day, you know. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. The first laptop is under 20,000 rupees per jet. Now under 20,000 rupees per jet, I personally suggest you to go for something which is used. Like uh, you can just find in your network or your contacts or your friends, anyone who really have a laptop which they are need to sell, like which would really be worth the benefit under 20,000 because under 20,000 price point today in this world, I mean in this uh, demand where we have lots of demand for the laptop, we are not going to get a better system or a better performance system for a 20,000 rupees budget point. If you are still looking to buy a new computer, then consider this the new avita pura apu dual core comes with a6 processor the apu dual core comes with 2.4 gigahertz speed 4 gb of ddr4 ram with 128 gb of ssd coupled with amd redon r4 inbuilt graphics 14 inch display slightly more than 720p and it has a only one c port now if you are considering to buy a new one and you are only want a new one under 20000 rupees point point I would suggest you to go with this Avita. The reason is quite simple guys because you know the brand comes with a warranty so that you can trust this new brand as they are the new manufacturers. As per the reviews there are no such big issues which users have faced as the brand comes with the warranty period. I prefer this is one of the best laptops under 20,000. The, the second laptop under 30,000 price point is the Acer Aspire 3. It is clocking the new AMD Athlon Silver 3050U dual core, 4 GB of DDR4 RAM comes along with 1 TB of hard drive, it's fair enough right for a home, and also comes with a, seven, a slightly higher than 720 pixels screen out there. This would be enough, and the company claims to have 6 hours of battery life, but again, uh, it would end up like something like 5 hours or 5.5 hours, right? They, got, they claim for it as 8 hours and you would get maybe like six to five to six hours that's more than enough for a computer for at this price point to have this another point to just to add on for the rupees of thirty thousand that is you can you can really like go for a used one even at this price point if you can find a better deal and the better processor like let's say if you're going for a use one then anything between i3 7 gen more than i3 7 gen and i5 6 gen under 30,000 please go for it even if it has a used one because go for price to the point performance thing so i would really suggest you guys to go for this laptop or or else find something better if you find a better deal which i have said, said like more than 7 gen of i3 and uh, more than 6 gen of i5 can do really better at this price point it's, you know this office what we're gonna use today really are like they are more CPU intensive and RAM consumption. So I highly recommend you guys to go for performance oriented rather than any other stuff. If you are if you wanna get your work done smoothly, again if you are focusing more on the uh, com compatibility or let's say you know portability than that, then that times you have to take a call and spending a little more money, right? Okay, the next laptop under 40,000 price point, which I'm gonna suggest is the Dell one. I guess I'll be listing it. Dell Vostro 3400 comes with i3 11 gen latest processor with 8 GB of DDR4 RAM, 1 terabyte hard drive, and also coupled with 256 GB storage, that is SSD. Comes with inbuilt Iris XE graphics, 14 inch full HD display, and Microsoft absolutely for free. It's clocking both hard drive and SSD. So now we have pretty much cleared all the price segments uh, except the most saturated or most confusions among the people that is best laptop under 50,000 rupees guys like 
there are so many literally so many options in the market if you go and check out on amazon flipkart right which one is the ideal because most of them kind of look similar at times also so here is my suggestion after purchasing one for myself can okay, guys you see i have your one after purchasing one for myself and checking many other people who have used a laptop which is my picks my personal picks are if you are a student if you are going to keep it at home for daily tasks if you are uh, doing something engineering possibly engineering interior design or for daily tasks then i highly recommend you to buy Acer Aspire 55 it comes with i5 11 gen processor 8 gb 1 terabyte hard drive 256 gb of additional ssd iris xc graphics 15.6 inch full hd display and comes with wifi 6 i guess wifi 6 is really important also for better internet speeds so this laptop is one of the best for a student or if you are going to keep it at home and use it for daily tasks under 50000 rupees now the second one is if you want if you are looking for something premium under 50000 for a student and and you using it something for the same thing even you are a student like you have to take it to college and you you have focus more on portability then uh, this one is the realme book right the realme book comes with i3 11 gen 8 gb ddr4 ram 256 gb ssd iris xc graphics 15 inch 2k display and this comes with a backlit keyboard microsoft office and a better battery i guess this is most important you are getting microsoft office for a student better battery backlit keyboard again you are compromising on performance and but you are a student you are going to be using your laptop only for minimal purposes like office uh, coding and maybe like uh, entry level graphic designing can also this laptop can handle right making websites uh, yeah this laptop can easily handle those stuffs again this is a premium one comes from realme and if you are looking for portability then i highly recommend you to go for this the next one probably my favorite and the thing which i have bought is if you are a content creator or you are a gamer or you are a coder or you want to watch movie or you want to create softwares or you want to build a website or you want to start a startup or anything which requires more a better performance laptop with graphics card more than if you want to edit videos if you want to have a graphics card if you want to also have an ssd then this is my pick that is none other than this one this mighty right here i guess it's in the wrong this mighty here which i am owning if you can see my new purchase i'm so happy for this uh, the acer aspire 7 this is clocking the i5 10 generation comes with 8 gb of ram 512 gb ssd nvidia gts 1650 4 gb graphics card with 15.6 inch 1080p full hd 1920 by 1080 pixels resolution display with wifi 6 and a backlit keyboard one of the best at this price point uh, and of course i have to like compromise on my battery but again the performance is at its price price to performance laptop if i could say because still i have bought it like maybe like 20 days it has been i'm just enjoying the experience and it's really great guys really like the best of the best purchase which i have done so far and i'm really happy for it guys i guys i have literally sat and used all most of the laptops and then have come to the conclusion because i took a lot of research before buying this one for me like i spent maybe like 2 months waited for festive season for offers and then i bought this at a reasonable price in today's video hope you guys liked it if you have any confusions please make sure you guys comment below and also you can just visit any of my uh, social media accounts and comment over there or you can directly instagram message me i would really be there to help you and solve your issue your chaos of which laptop to buy thank you so much for watching guys this is yadu signing off for now